Yeah, you already know what it is, man. It's your boy Kills with Frosty Flappers the Movie, Flappers the Movie 2 on the way, God City, God City TV, Gangs the City, God City Podcast, God City Everything, man. Tonight I'm bringing some sad news to y'all. King's face, conservative black, conservative thug has passed away um, due to his kidney failure. I'll stick to that. But I know there was a lot of controversy surrounding his name. Uh, a young lady came out, said that she he infected her with HIV and that he might be going through. He was in a coma maybe because of HIV. Um, it wasn't proven. Um, Tony X and Young Farrell also said that they said they had the proof. Well, I'm pretty sure now that he passed away that they should be able to pr- provide the proof to the people. Um... Like I said, it's a sad case, though, either way, because he was a young black brother making strides for the black community. Rather, he was a Republican. As long as he had the goals of black people in his sight, I didn't really see nothing wrong with what he was doing. Um, anyway, I'm going to play a clip of when the time he was on our show, God City Podcast, and um, he gave some his insights on his point in of view. our community, which, which gives us capital mm-hmm. for us to be R. able R. to open up businesses. Man. Like, if you want to open a business, it's gonna, and you're going to hire people in the community and make sure, you know, these are the things that we need in order for us to advance. You know what I mean? Because we about a government. This 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 president is not about handouts. He's about giving you opportunity, which is two different things. You know what I mean? A handout is welfare, Section Eight, food stamps. These are handouts. You know what I'm saying? He wants to give you opportunity. Meaning, look, if you got a good idea, hopefully everything. um, We're gonna make sure you get that loan. Clears up. That I think that's important, especially in our community, because all the problems we we have. I think we overlook past that. Yeah, because people get emotional because they hear the whole racist talk, you know, and which there's no proof anywhere. That's what I, that's what I was just saying. Racist. I think people go more, more of um, emotion than facts. It, because when it comes that, to Trump. that's what we was taught as as black people. We we've been t- majority of us raised by our mother. Yeah, seventy percent of us raised by our mothers. You know what I mean? So even in our in our community. My condolences out to the family, man. Um, like I said, man, my condolences out to the family. I know I'm breaking out the news a little early for the people, but I felt like the fans, the strong following, they always asked me what's going on. So I figured once I got the news for them, they kept asking me what's going on, what's going on. And I felt like it was only right that I let the people know what's going on. Um, like I said again, if the allegations against him were true, um, I wouldn't stand by him. I would say that was fucked up as an individual. As a man to do that But if the allegations are false um, Then I'll feel like um, Young Farrell and Tony X On my apology um, So hopefully that they could come out with the evidence Everybody was saying they had evidence um, With FBI and stuff But at this point in time He passed away um, Who's really to blame Like there's no um, They need to just put out the evidence if it's true Because if it's not then the young brother Need to be celebrated for who he was But if it's true then you know, he would be condemned as for who he was. Um, sad case, man. Lesson to everybody out there, man. You got to be careful. Never forget COVID is out here. I understand everybody wants to wear a mask. Uh, just in case, man, just make sure you wear protection as well. Um, King Face, man, that's um, one of the brothers I knew from way back, way back when we were growing up. Um, we were actually in the streets. It, I was proud to see him doing what he does. He was proud to see what doing what I does. Um, like I said, from what I knew the, the brother from, I always knew him from a great angle. I never knew him for uh, uh, for being a messed up guy. So um, really and truly, the allegations that I heard against him were kind of hard for me to believe. But like I said, you can't go against evidence. Facts are facts, like you know. Um, I'm a realist, so I try to stick to the facts of what's re- reality. Um, so if, um, like I said, um, my condolences to his family. Um, my heart goes out to them. My heart also goes out to the la- to to the lady that claimed that um, he gave her HIV. If that's true, um, my prayers out to you, baby. I see you. You, you you're taking it in stride. If it's true, I, I see you're taking it in stride. Um, it's not too much to say. I feel like the Repu- Republican Party kind of lost a good, a good. Um, he's not even a pawn on the chessboard. A good may, um, I'll say a knight, a good knight, because he was made really making strides in what he was doing. It doesn't matter if you're a Republican or you're a Democrat, but as long as you got the um, the 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 best intentions for the black people at the end of your goals, that's what really matters. Like, and I think a lot of people need to understand that because a lot of people say hurtful stuff. 
But anyway, man, you know what it is. Subscribe is at K-A-Y-O-S-O-F-R-O-S-T-Y. Holla at your boy, man. All right.